Hello everyone. Welcome to our YouTube channel Premiere Next. In this video, you are going to get all information related to the latest updates of the series The Boy's Presence, Diabolical. Introduction of the series The Boy's Presence, Diabolical. Super-fueled children cutting down SWAT groups, a whole Melander prequel history, and all the typical sort of disorder that fans have come to cherish from The Boys. These are only a couple of the treats that anticipate watchers of The Boy's Presence, Diabolical, a vivified spin-off of Amazon's well-known and terribly engaging riff on superheroes, Skullwags, and every one of poor people, ordinary, non-controlled spirits trapped in the middle of them. Superheroes are clearly partaking in their prime right now, thanks in enormous part to the out-of-control accomplishment of the Marvel Cinematic Universe and Warner Bros. DC Universe putting forth a valiant effort to get up to speed. In any case, with such countless long periods of clear strength, it was just regular that this sort would at last get something of a pushback. Zack Snyder did all that could be expected while messing about in the DC sandbox, However presently the fight to strike another kind of hero tone has moved to the little screen with endeavors like Strong, HBO Max's Harley Quinn and Peacemaker, and The Boys. This more troublemaker-like mentality will maybe best be addressed by The Boys, Diabolical. The enlivened series seems as though it'll show up cocked and locked with positively no nonsense at all conveying considerably a greater amount of the hard-edged thrills advocated in the first series. With the debut day quick drawing closer, it's about time that those possibly keen on the show hopefully looked out for a way to improve on all that they need to be aware of the forthcoming show. A plot of the series The Boys' Presence, Diabolical. The Boys' Presence, Diabolical has been portrayed as a collection series, highlighting eight all-out episodes going from 12 to 14 minutes each. The Vivified project accompanies months worth of exhibition after its unexpected declaration in December of 2021. As maker Eric Cripp said in a proclamation at that point, shock. We're nearly gotten done with eight episodes of our enlivened series, Insidious. We assembled a few extraordinary makers and we gave them one rule. Simply joking, there's no standards. They passed the entryways over it, conveying a totally startling, interesting, stunning, shocking, clammy, mental episodes. You think the boys is nuts? Stand by till you see this. Every episode covers an altogether unique part of the unnerving and honestly disagreeable looking universe of the boys. Intriguingly, every episode has been painstakingly aligned to its specific subject material, adding a slick visual reach to the whole series that vows to have something for everybody. A Rick and Morty-impacted episode will embrace the recognizable energized style of the cherished satire series, one more will take motivation from Korean dramatization and frightfulness, but one more will be roused by French funnies and liveliness. You can observe the total rundown of episode titles and their specific enlivened specialties here, yet something lets us know this will make for a changed and engaging watch paying little mind to the amount you are familiar with going in. The casts of the series The Boys' Presence, Diabolical. Since the series is enlivened doesn't mean Amazon isn't putting it all out there for devilish. Though you may be enticed to imagine that it will not have the option to rival the elegant cast of the first surprisingly realistic series which flaunts Carl Urban as Billy Butcher, Jack Quaid as Huey Campbell, Aaron Moriarty as the sup named Starlight, Karen Fukuhara as Kim Maiko, and significantly more, a large number of those huge names will get back to repeat their jobs and loan their voice to their individual characters all through the energized series. Watchers can hope to see fan most loved cast individuals, for example, Anthony Starr as Hall Melander, Elizabeth Shue as his upsetting mother figure semi love interest, Chase Crawford's sub called The Deep, and Giancarlo Esposito as Vought CEO Stan Edgar. Concerning novices to the establishment who fans will without a doubt perceive, those a huge number of popular countenances that incorporate Asha Tyler, Aquafina, Andy Samberg, Ben Schwartz, Don Cheadle, Elliot Glazer, Jason Isaacs, Justin Royal and John DiMaggio, Keenan Thompson, Karen Culkin, 
Kevin Smith, Kumail Nanjani, Michael Sara, Nassim Padraig, and Simon Pegg. Information about the release date and trailer of the series The Boys Presence, Diabolical. Fret not, hero fans. Watchers have become acclimated to checking out Amazon Prime Video for new episodes of The Boys and, as you'd expect, a similar will remain constant for The Boys Presence, Diabolical. The side project series will make a big appearance on the web-based feature for supporters on March 4, 2022. In a recognizable change from The Boys, which circulated each new episode in week-by-week -week portions spread out north of half a month, every one of the eight episodes of Detestable will be made accessible for spilling simultaneously. This really notices back to the presentation period of The Boys, which comparably debuted the whole season all the while to rustle up certain informal exchange at the same time. In that light, it makes sense that the imaginative group would adopt a similar strategy for the primary period of Underhanded, on the off chance that fan request prompts the chance of much more vivified experiences from here on out, set in the realm of The Boys. If you are watching this video on Facebook please like and subscribe to our Facebook page and if you are watching this video on YouTube please click on the like button and do subscribe for the latest update.